Hello friends, welcome back to another video on Android development. In this video, we will learn how we can update the data on the Firebase. In this application, we will create one more button that is update button. And when we click on that button, we, our particular data will be update. So let, let's create it. Go to the Android Studio and go to the main activity dot XML. And here we will create one more button. So just copy this button and paste it below now just change this text into update and now it is below of this btn btn read so just paste it here and give the id of this button let's say btn update okay now copy now copy this btn update and paste it here okay now here we have update button so just go to the main activity and initialize that button so here we can say btn update okay now initialize this btn update so just duplicate this line and change the names okay now we will set a click listener of this btn update so go down and here we can say btn update dot set on click listener new on click listener okay after clicking on this btn update we will get the data from the input fields so in the previous video we have get the data so copy that data now go to the firebase and now in this video we will update any of one field so let's update the names so name under this user one so go to the firebase and here is reference that is user but we need user user one so here we will create the reference that is root reference dot child that is user one okay finally we reached on the user one now here we will call the method update children and here we will pass the hash map so first we will create the hash map so here we have to create the hash map and again hash map new hash map and now assign value hash map dot put and here we call it name and the second parameter again data so we will update only name this one so just copy this name and paste it here okay now pass this hash map in this method hash map and finally we will call add on success listener new on success listener so put a semicolon here and here we will show a toast message okay your data is successfully updated okay now there is no need of now there is no need of this id so just comment this because we are going to update only name and now run the application okay our application is successfully running and now open the firebase database and let's type here name this is the second input field that is name input field so let's say i type abc and now click on the update now here you can see our name is updated and you can see a toast message so in this way you can update your data and now if you want to update both fields so go to the firebase sorry android studio and remove this command 
and now add this hash map here add the id and just give the id okay now over both fields are updated now run the application again okay application again running on the emulator let me open the firebase and application let's see i type the id one two three four five and give the name again xyz now click on the update now here you can see over both fields are updated so in this way you can update your data on the firebase so if you have any question please ask me in the comment section please like my video share my video and subscribe my channel thank you